Vertex chose to transition to the new standard because we're a consulting firm and we're helping our clients implement uh, their own quality management system and achieve their ISO certification. So it totally makes sense for us that we were uh, going to transition to the new standard and in fact it was a strategic goal of ours to be um, amongst the first company in Canada to achieve that certification. Vertex has been preparing for the transition for quite some times now. We've been following the whole process for a year and a half and we've been closely watching every draft release uh, about uh, this new uh, ISO 2015 uh, transition. We had to be proactive on that end so we aligned uh, our uh, quality management system with the requirements of the new standard. The benefits of the new standard for Vertex are multiple. It helps us uh, with our governance. We now have more qual uh, clarity on what we need to do for the upcoming years. Uh, our quality management system is now fully in aligned with our strategic business plan. Uh, it also helped us mobilize all of our employees toward that initiative and all of our, our employees now understand the key matrix and the, the success factor that uh, is going to help drive uh, Vertex towards a, a, a sustainable growth uh, through the next year. So it, it helps us out in a business way and in an operational way. The new uh, standard is uh, better for our business because uh, overall it's uh, strategically improving uh, uh, the way we deliver uh, our services to our clients. Also uh, it gives us more uh, clarity on what we need to do for the upcoming years, either internally to even increase uh, the quality of our services and externally on how we should uh, achieve our goal and develop new markets. My top tips for the company wishing to transition uh, to the new standard would be as follow. First, you need to find a competent certification body that will be a, a partner in the, in the whole process. Also, this should be a, an opportunity to fully leverage your uh, quality management system and make sure it's fully aligned with uh, your business plan and strategic plan. The key issue is that you need to have the, the collaboration and the full support of your upper management. The new standard is now more than ever closely related to the upper management preoccupations. And in that sense, they need to be the real sponsors uh, of the transition.